I'm staying right here. I'm not going nowhere. Betty Rio sits under an umbrella on the side of Stockton Boulevard, her arm in a sling. She says she was roughed up while being evicted from the homeless camp where she's lived for years. It was hectic. Really hectic. <laughs> She was one of the nearly 100 people told to pack up and leave. We didn't even know they were there until we woke up and saw those pink slips. Sacramento County deputies left notices days ago before giving the order this morning. Construction crews and dump trucks picked up tents, tarps, and trash. This was no surprise to them. Um, this was posted. Um, it was posted on the property. It would be coming back in 72 hours. Demonstrators and homeless advocates faced off with deputies, some shouting as officers stood their ground. We've been fighting and fighting and butting heads and... There's no resource at the end of the day. Don't, 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 don't. The sheriff's office says two demonstrators were taken into custody, cited, then released. One man living at the homeless camp was arrested, charged with obstruction and violating a probation order. I am homeless. All my stuff comes out of a dumpster. But there's still my things, you know? Um, I can get more dumpster stuff. Brian Noble says it's been hard watching others get evicted. He knows what it's like to be homeless. He spent years living along the river. Now, he hopes others can get the help they need. Everybody's doing their own, fighting their own battle. You know what I mean? You know, and, and, and we're all trying to just get by. Emily Maha, KCRA 3 News.